Hey guys, welcome back to Kawaii Toy Collector. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make no glue lotion slime. So yeah, also guys, hashtag notification squad for my last week's video is... Also, remember, please leave a like and subscribe to Quiet Collector in the comments down below. Give us some video ideas. So let's get right into the video. Okay, guys. So the ingredients you guys need to make this no glue slime recipe today is any type of hand soap. I'm using a soft soap. You guys don't need any type of lotion. I'm using this one from Bath and Body Works, which is strawberry pound cake. I love this one. You guys need a boiler plate to make your slime in. You guys will need a mixing tool. And optional is food coloring. I'm using this pink food coloring. I also want to say, please ignore how I sound. I am sick once again. I have no idea why I'm getting sick so often, but I am. I have a cold and a virus, and it just is messing up with how I sound and stuff, and that's why I've been so inactive for the past few days on here. So I'm so sorry for being so inactive for me, you guys, but I am back today filming a video, even though I sound horrible. <laughs> but I'm getting better, so that's good. So the first thing I have to do for this slime ice pudding is add in your soap into your bowler plate. And I'm adding in the soft soap, and that looks like just enough. And I'm going to add my food coloring. And I'm going to add about, I think I'm going to add like a drop or two. For, I'm going to add one drop at first and see how that works. And I'm just going to mix up the hand soap right now to get super bubbly. And this is going to create like a glue texture. Okay, that looks like just enough mixing for that. And I feel like that's enough food coloring you guys also don't have to add food coloring i'm just adding it into this because i want it to be more colorful <laughs> and now i'm gonna add my lotion into here and you don't have to add too much i'm just gonna add just just enough right there and now i'm gonna mix it again i also wanted to add in this video this is where i went wrong for this recipe make sure you add more soap and less lotion just because it will be very runny so make sure you guys do that Okay, that looks like just enough mixing for this and I did add in more hand soap just because I want it to be a little bit more of like a soap like texture. So now I'm going to put my lid on the container and I'm going to put this into the refrigerator for about 3 hours. Every 30 minutes I'm going to take a look at it and make sure it's working. So I'll see you guys in about a second when it's all done. Just remember to mix it a lot and make sure to add less lotion than hand soap. So I'll see you guys in about a second. Okay guys, so it's been about three hours and I did add way more lotion and I also added some more food coloring in here and I have not been able to get it off my hands, so don't mind that. But here it is, I'm really excited to see how the texture is on here. And yeah, I added way more lotion as you can just tell. But the texture looks really nice as I can see already. Oh my god, look at this. It's really, really sticky though. I, I can tell right away. I love the color. I'm so happy I added some more food coloring in here. And I added way more lotion. And I thought if I added more lotion, it would be more runny when I put it into the freezer, the refrigerator. But it actually made it turn into like a better like lotion slime texture, as you can see. So I know before when I told you guys, I'll see you guys in about a second when it's, well, it's in the fridge, it was actually way more of like a clear type of slime, but I added more lotion that made it way thicker, and it just seems like it's just a better texture than my normal lotion slime recipe, so maybe try adding more lotion into this slime recipe and it will work and be more thicker, if that makes any sense, I probably don't sound like I'm saying anything right right now it's probably my brain because i'm really sick but <laughs> try to add some more lotion instead of soap for this recipe and if that doesn't work just try going with the normal recipe which is soap and adding a little bit of lotion either way this recipe worked really awesome for me and i love the color on here i'm so happy i added some more food coloring and lotion into this Yes, but here's how you make no glue lotion slime. I really hope you guys like this video today. The comments will probably be turned off on this. I've been turned off most of my no glue slime recipes recently, which I don't know why, but it's been really annoying me. So make sure to check out my community tab on my YouTube channel to comment for hashtag notification squad. And you can be in a video like the people who were in the video earlier today. But yeah, remember to please leave a like and subscribe to Quiet Collector in the comments down below. Give me some new ideas. Bye guys, love you so much and peace. Remember, thumbs up for no glue slime recipes and check out all my social medias. They will be linked in the description box down below. Bye!